Hey Lobos, hope you're doing well. Uh, this week, we're going to be looking at typing.com to improve our typing speed and our typing accuracy. And the most important part of this is making sure that your fingers are in the right place um, and you're using the right finger to hit the right key. We call this home row. So using home row, you can type super fast. Um, if you don't use home row and you're using your fingers like this, um, it's going to be really hard to become a proficient typer. Okay. So we're going to go into typing.com and I'll show you how to get set up with home row. Let's do it. All right. So first we're in our seesaw. We need to click on our technology week four typing skills lesson. You need to watch this video. You're going to set the timer for 20 minutes to practice. And then you're going to upload uh, an image of your accomplishment of your certificate when you're done. So first let's check out our objective. Today we are learning to type using home row. We are using typing.com to learn home row typing and track our speed, words per minute and accuracy. Typing online is a super powerful tool if we learn how to type um, accurately and efficiently. So to start, you need to click on the typing.com link and log into typing.com. Now it says join Mr. Clifton's class. So use your existing typing.com account and sign in with Google. Click on your name and then click allow. Now you're all set in your account and you are in Mr. Clifton's class. So if you used typing.com before, you might have chosen a theme. This student has chosen the alien theme, which looks really cool. You can change your theme anytime at the top of the website. But to start today, you need to pick your lesson. So along the side, you can you can click to continue your beginner lessons, or you can click some of the lessons that are in the middle of your screen. Let's click resume on beginner. Now, as you can see, I have what I need to type up above, and then my hands are down below. These alien hands are on home row. Notice the left finger is on F and the right is on J. If I follow the hands, if I follow the hands, the alien hands on my screen, I can, I know exactly where each letter is on my keyboard. Do your best to keep your hands on home row the entire time. Once I'm done typing with the activity, it shows me my words per minute, 22 words per minute. That's how fast I typed. And I had 100% accuracy, which is great. I didn't make any mistakes. Accuracy is when you hit the right key at the right time. Now, sometimes in your lessons, they'll throw in a game or two. This game's really fun because you're hopping on donuts. Donuts are delicious. If I go back to my home page, I can see at the top I have a bunch of different bunch of different options. I can go to achievements, games, tests, or themes to change the theme. Let's click on achievements. For this lesson, I want you to upload a screenshot of your badges from your lessons that you earned during your work today. You need to upload your screenshot to Seesaw. I can take a screenshot by holding down Control, Shift, and then the Window key. That's perfect. Now I go back into Seesaw 
and I add a student response. Click add response. And I upload my screenshot to my Seesaw account. Next, I click the checkbox and I can record something. I can type in something about the lesson. And then I click the green checkbox to upload. And now you can see my badges are in my lesson. That shows Mr. Clifton that that'll show me that you did, you completed the assignment and you are rocking with typing.com. Next, I want to show you my hands as I type. Now I see a lot of students type with one with two fingers. Okay. It is really slow to type with two fingers. And it's really going to be hard to become a proficient typer and use the typing tools to your advantage. Now watch my hands as I use home row. I'm following the race car driver hands that are in front of me. Notice how my hands always return back to home row, just like the race car driver hands in front. This takes a lot of practice, but as you learn and you memorize where the, where the keys are on your keyboard, you will get faster and faster and more proficient and more accurate. All right, y'all, that's typing.com. Practice every day for at least 15 minutes to become a typing master. Have fun and enjoy typing.com.